there's room out wide here for Dani Alves to deliver. Oh, it's a good ball in. And Cavani. Lovely pass for Kurosawa. And that has it's to be offside. offside against Cavani. I'll tell you what, though, Rob, they move the ball so well. Every player in this PSG side is accomplished. And Roberts lets that ball. Benati floats one forward. Back for Cavani. Saved by Craig Gordon. Lined on it. On the counter. Rabio threads it through. And Neymar! Opens the scoring for Paris Saint-Germain. Nineteen minutes gone, and that is the big breakthrough. Yeah, and you can hear the boos around the stadium. I think the referee should bring that back for a foul on Scott Sinclair, but then Ralston just switches off. Neymar's onside. He does really well. And what about the... What can Celtic make of this? Lee Griffiths, great strike. I tell you, he must be all of 40 yards. He's got no right to shoot from there. He gets so much pace on. It's Neymar again, missed by Cavani. But Kylian Mbappe fires in the second goal. Two goals in two games for the teenage sensation, and Celtic are two goals behind. Well, they're just a class apart, aren't they? PSG really down the line for Kozawa. Down goes Cavani. Penalty given. It is a penalty kick and a booking for Shimunovic, and a chance for PSG to go three goals in front. Well. Keeping the ball easy. It's Cavani and it is 3 0. Cavani, Neymar, Mbappe, the big three with the goals. Five minutes away from half time. Well, there's a silly penalty to give away. Twisting away from Sinclair, firing the ball across goal, and it's an own goal. Mikel Lustig puts the ball in the back of his own net and PSG have a 4 0 lead. Yeah, and it's superb from Draxler off the bench. Talk about the other three forwards. Just breezes past Scott Sinclair. Lustig's a bit unlucky on the far. Trotted away by Lustig. Kurzawa for 